Alright, so what's going on guys, and welcome back to another video, where today I will show you how to make a strength potion, and I do muck up in one of the parts that I actually place a blaze rod in the bruise dam, which needs to be blaze powder, but I am sorry about that, I might trim it out, I might not, for entertainment I might, I might not, but yeah. Anyway guys, I hope you do enjoy this video of me making a strength potion, it is pretty long, I'm sorry, um, but yeah. It's a strength potion. Strength potion is actually one of the useful things. If you can, there, here. Skeleton, one hit. No, nope, we don't have a strength potion. There we go. So, I will be showing you in this video how to make a strength potion. Hope you guys enjoy. Here you go. Alright, so what's going on, guys? And welcome back to another video. Well, today we are back on our potion world making another potion. And today might be an interesting one and another helpful one. Today we will be learning how to make a strength potion. So the materials you are going to need for this is if we look in this chest, we need three glass bottles, one nether wart, one blaze rod, and for some extra ness, we need one glowstone and one redstone. And I also forgot to grab some gunpowder. And, yeah, these three materials, um, um, we, yeah, hold on. Th these three materials you're going to need to make it more awesome, but, uh, three glass bottles, one nether wart, one blaze rod is all you really need. I just come, just came back from school, so, um, I'm probably going to be not so talky. Here's the wall potions. I'm not going to get rid of this because this has been since day one of the potion videos. I'm not going to get rid of that. So now the next thing we are going to do is L2. Nope, that's lava. Sorry, I'm getting mixed up today. L2, L2, and L2. And we go into our brewing stand here. You can use the analog stick or you can just press triangle which is easier and then you put some nether wart so we can turn this into an aqua potion okay let's now see if it is ready it should be yep now we need to add our material or the main one is a blaze rod how you get a blaze rod you need to kill a blaze right like it probably won't give you it the first time maybe not the second time maybe and the third time, maybe. But yeah, it is a little bit an insuency rare chance. Not that rare, but it's a little, little, little bit. But once you have your blaze rod from killing a blaze, probably a few times, you put it in, and now we just wait until it is done. Okay, I've done something really wrong. Really, really, really wrong. Um, you actually have to go to your crafting table and make blaze powder. <laughs> so, yeah, you need one blaze rod and you just find bla uh, blaze powder in the food area. Isn't that hard? Um, you press X and you have your blaze powder. I really did mess that up. So you wait until that is done cooking. And I also want want to let you guys know a little bit of changes that might go on in the channel. I have made some playlists to keep my videos organized because, you know, I used to just upload videos and now it's all in a mess. So now you can just find it in the playlist. But not all the videos are yet sorted, so you're going to have to wait to that or just find the video until I create the playlist for it. And some other videos are going to probably come back to the channel later on probably in the month or in October, like the Micro Survival Series. I just haven't had the time to play or to get Fusion, or I just haven't had the time to record it. And also the Battlefront Series, which I still need to work on. Um, we did get a memory card, so now our files did save. And we'll also probably, now that we have a memory card, be playing Battlefront 1. Battlefront 1 is a pretty awesome game, too. So, those are a few changes that will probably be happening, or have now been happening, or later going to be happening. 
So I'm, I'm looking forward to doing probably the bathroom series more. So here is your potion of strength. So this is all you really need to do. You can end the video here. But to make it a little bit better, and sorry that the camera angle is not at, at the best. Um, once, and this one has, um, this one actually has a percent, if you can see, not really. Like, there, like in like the indigo color, you can see 130 uh, percent attack damage. So this is what, this is gonna make glowstone come in handy. But first we want to turn this into splash. So how you get gunpowder, you kill a creeper. How you get redstone, you go mining. How you get glowstone, you kill blaze. So we want to do this kind of in an order. You want to put gunpowder, then redstone, then glowstone. And that should do it. My voice is not at, it, at its best today, and I'm probably going to be mucking on my sentences a lot. So I'm probably going to trim out a lot of bits that I'm probably going to trim out. Yeah, okay, I probably will. So, um, there's actually a way I can speed up videos, but I don't know how, you know, kind of. So, and also, I will, uh, no, you play sports now. Um, I think now I'm going to start, like, uploading videos, not daily. I'm going to be recording a video, editing it, and then upload it. Because if, you know, I record it, upload it, edit it, but, you know, to edit it, I need to upload it, but I need to private the video so no one sees the video before I actually upload it. I private it, I do the editing, and I upload it and make it public and then that's basically how it goes here we go we get six minutes now so it's probably gonna go back to three or four or five place your glowstone and yeah so there are a few changes coming um, to the channel and you know I like editing videos but it does take a little bit that's why I that's why it has been a few days now but I did upload two videos yesterday that are now edited um, unboxing ATT I had to actually split into two parts because my camera shut off and I had to edit it and make here's part two so basically you know you watch the first part and then it says here's part two and then the next bit is just part two so that's technically how it works and there should always be a link in the description when I edit my videos um, to the uh, to the YouTube editor, which is what I use to edit these videos nowadays. And here you go, guys. Potion of Strength. Awesome, right? So, we actually need some test subjects. So I'll be right back when I have some test subjects. And here we go. I've gotten some spawn eggs here. Your potions. So we're not gonna start off with creepers. So we there's our spider. We only have an iron sword, which doesn't do that much. Press L2 on the ground, and now this should. Hold on. Sorry about that noise in the background. I will maybe trim it out. But that's how it, it's actually really effective. This does 260. That's a lot. So if we spawn on our spider, oh, we got a thingy. I don't know what it's called. See, as you can tell, the strength potion actually kills mobs in one hit, which is actually really useful in case you're going against a bunch of mobs. There we go. And yeah, a healing potion would come in handy right about now if we had one, but we haven't put it up in the wall. But anyway, guys, that's how you that's how you make a strength potion it's actually really really useful it's probably one of the useful ones i do like i don't have an item frame i'm just gonna go to creative quickly and grab one so yeah guys that's been the end of this video here and hope you guys enjoyed it and leave a like if you did subscribe if you are new to the channel which there should be an annotation on screen right about now there we go and yeah, let's just place it there. Anyway, guys, that's been it. And see you guys all later.
Bye. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching this video. And as you can tell, it wasn't the best, but at least we made a strength potion. You guys now know the next one is going to be night vision now. I'm sorry that I said that I was going to make um, night vision, but, I, but then I realized that strength is actually easier to make. And, yeah. So now we will be making night vision. It is confirmed that we will be making night vision in the next video, guys. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed that. Leave a like if you did. And I will see you guys all in the next video. Bye. And make sure to subscribe.